What's going on, Jay Cutler fans and carb lovers worldwide? My name is Mike Roberto. I'm the founder of Price Blog. Today, I have the honor of introducing to you Jay Cutler's Cutler Nutrition Transfer, which is a glucose disposal agent supplement that is meant to help you get your carbohydrates where they belong, and that's in your muscle tissue. The whole idea, this, this is a glucose disposal agent type of supplement. The whole idea is that we wanna drive insulin sensitivity so that if you're in a post-workout state or you've worked out hard in the last 24 hours, which will be most of Jay Cutler's fans out there, you're gonna be able to use this to help drive more of those carbohydrates, more of that blood sugar into muscle cells as opposed to fat cells or liver cells, or even worse, allowing it to just float around the bloodstream causing toxic effects. And it's really a simple yet incredibly effective formula with just two ingredients. And that's Glucovantage dihydroberberine. Glucovantage is an ingredient made by NNB Nutrition. And then we have Ceylon cinnamon, just regular old cinnamon in the product, which will also work as an insulin uh, mimicker as well. So today we're gonna focus in on the Glucovantage dihydroberberine because I just love this stuff. I've tested this in my blood work and I have always, basically it's never failed me and I love the way that they're dosing this here with Cutler Transfer. So what we have here on the label in two capsules, and I'll, I'll show you a capsule, we'll do some B-roll as well, but in two capsules you have 170 milligrams of dihydroberberine from Glucovantage, and you have 750 milligrams of cinnamon. And that is it, it's a super awesome, effective way to see how these two ingredients work for you. And they work with two different mechanisms that we'll talk about so that you can get as, uh, a really simple but powerful response to your sugars, to get your blood sugar back down where it belongs, and drive it into the muscles, and then you can get on with your day. And so I, 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 I've gone on the record, I, Glucovantage to me is the most important and the, the, seriously the most health beneficial ingredient in my opinion on, as to anything else on the market. There might be like one other ingredient, but as far as blood sugar control and lipid levels and overall metabolic health goes, dihydroberberine is where it's at. And this is an advanced form of berberine. So we're gonna take a step back, we're gonna talk about what berberine is, and then we're going to talk about why dihydroberberine or glucovantage is better. But first off, the, the, the main gist here is that we wanna use this about 15 minutes before eating a carbohydrate-based meal. So for you bigger boys, and a lot of you who follow Jay Cutler, take two capsules before your biggest carb meal of the day, and maybe one other capsule before another carb-based meal uh, elsewhere in the day, and you're gonna notice that you're gonna have a little bit of a better time dealing with those carbohydrates and getting blood sugars back to, back to regular. The best way to really track it is to get a constant glucose monitor, which I have tested with this stuff, but uh, in general, you could also do the skin pricks and everything as well, or just go by feel. A lot of times you know when you're too high for too long. It's not a good feeling. Um, and then beyond that, uh, for, but the good thing is that even in just one capsule, you're going to get 85 milligrams of dihydroberberine. And I think that's like a perfect dose for smaller people or for women or for people who are larger, but kind of like on a lower carb side of things. Like if you're maybe eating under 50 grams of carbs, I, I, honestly, I think one capsule would probably be best. But again, the blood test and the, uh, the skin pricking and everything will probably guide you the best. So that's kind of the strategy. 15 min minutes before carbohydrate containing meals. If you forget and you're halfway through your sweet potato, just you could take it during, but it might be a little bit less beneficial. Keep it coming on a daily basis. So what happens here is that, that berberine is, is an ingredient that has been shown time and time again to improve all kinds of metabolic levels, uh, ranging from lipid levels to average blood sugar levels to acute blood sugar levels to uh, even like your A1C levels and not your A1C levels, but the participants in the studies A1C levels to the point where a full clinical dose of the regular berberine has outperformed very, very, very popular pharmaceutical drugs with less side effects. Berberine is awesome. The problem is this, that study needed 1500 milligrams of berberine per day. That is basically three capsules and then you're not gonna have room for much else, which isn't the end of the world, but at the same time, the 1500 milligrams of berberine per day, what the studies have shown is that it's not as bioavailable and it leads to GI discomfort. And that's where Sean Wells at NNB Nutrition and a couple other people realized that one of berberine's metabolites 
actually works far better than regular berberine at a lower dose, leading to less GI discomfort because it has such a higher bioavailability. The, the way this works, this is an herb that when you ingest the berberine, it breaks down in your, in your gut into a metabolite known as dihydroberberine. It then passes through into the plasma where it becomes berberine again. So what the researchers realized, Sean Wells and, and friends, they realized is that you could actually just take the dihydroberberine, you need less of it, and then it'll get converted back into berberine uh, anyway. And you're gonna get the same effects, but need far less of it, and you're gonna have less residual loss, and then that's gonna cause less GI discomfort. And the research shows that it works five times better than a similar dose of berberine. So in my opinion, berberine is a fantastic ingredient, but dihydroberberine is the future of this ingredient and glucovantage is, how you, is the name of the ingredient that you can find. So I absolutely love this stuff. And what this does is it basically stimulates your AMP K levels, which is short for AMP activated protein kinase, which we like really in one quick sentence, we call it our we need energy now enzyme. And what this does is it helps drive the carbohydrates, sugars, and fatty acids into cells. What, and with berberine, it's able to upregulate and stimulate this enzyme's release. So that's kind of like the really quick you know, mechanism of, of action and everything. But the long story short is that post-workout, we're generally not gonna eat a ton of fats or anything. It's really about driving the carbohydrates into muscle cells. And that's what we're gonna get here. And so what they realized though is that berberine caused a lot of GI discomfort, especially if those higher doses. Dihydroberberine solves those problems and Glucovantage is the ingredient that does it. I think it's absolutely fantastic. I've, like I've said, I've blood tested this stuff and it works incredibly well. I don't eat the most carbohydrates <laughs> as anyone on this, uh, on this, let's say, platform here, but when I do carb up, I definitely make sure that I get Glucovantage in. And lately, I've been, I mean, there's, honestly, there's a lot of Glucovantage based supplements out there. Some of them have like, four or five, six other ingredients, and they're very complicated. You don't know like what's doing what. If you're really like new, or if you, first off, you just want something simple, and you like simple formulas, this is where it's at. Simple, effective. However, uh, if you're new to like dihydroberberine or berberine, and you wanna know how it feels without having the compounds of a bunch of other ingredients, this is the place to start. Start with just one capsule, have some carbs, see how you feel, go work out the next day, and see how much better of a pump you get too. And if you're a pre-workout um, carb kind of person, Take it before those pre-workout carbs, carb up a little bit extra, and then you know add in the, the Cutler Prevail uh, Amplify stack while you're at it, and then watch what happens. You get a filthy pump, and so like make sure you carb up like well with it though, and it's it's an incredible thing. I'm usually personally into post-workout carbs, and then finally you have cinnamon, which works a little bit differently, and this is a pretty high dose too. And this the standard spice that we use in our oatmeal and baking goods and everything works great in oatmeal. Works great as an insulin mimicker, and so this actually, uh, just like it sounds like, it kind of mimics the actual the action of insulin. So if your body is perhaps not producing enough insulin to handle the load of carbs that you're throwing at it, this can help um, help you know, double, or not, not double, but help replicate that action a little bit more. And just like with Glucovantage, the research has shown that the participants are able to lower their average blood glucose levels and their acute blood glucose levels after ingesting carbohydrates because you don't wanna have your blood, we, we're all for getting insulin up there, getting carbohydrates in, and getting your blood sugar up. However, you don't want your blood sugar to be high forever. The best thing to do is put on a monitor and test it out and, and you know have 75 grams of dextrose. I like to use sweet tarts as my source of dextrose and see where you're at. After like one, if you're, after two hours, your blood sugar is still like over 200, you might have a little bit of an insulin sensitivity problem. And it might be time to either train harder, maybe have to go a little bit lower carb, or maybe get a little bit of help. And I think the pair of dihydroberberine from Glucovantage and, and cinnamon is an incredible way to make that happen. Both very, very clinically backed and a simple supplement, two regular capsules, and you're ready to rock and roll. So I did mention, we don't have a business affiliation re relationship with Cutler Nutrition, but this product was sent for free, and we do have a business affiliation relationship with NMB Nutrition, the creators of Glucovantage. Super, super bullish on this stuff. Jay Cutler, I am so happy that you chose just an effective formula with well-dosed, ingredients that are cutting edge yet not overcomplicated. Like this is exactly what we like to see from Cutler Nutrition. The Prevail Amplify stack does the exact same thing. Not too much, but enough to like seriously work.
And so if you're carving up or you're feeling like you're, there's a lot of ways. There's the diet path here and then there's the Balkan path. Right now it's fall, it's November of 2021. And so if it's, uh, so it's bulking season. And if you're gonna bulk up, you know what? Bulk up, but first take some transfer beforehand. Thanks for following Priceline.com slash Cutler-Nutrition so you can sign up for the alerts. And you can go to also Priceline.com slash NNB-Nutrition to learn and click on the news articles and you can learn about all these crazy ingredients that NNB Nutrition has. Lots of other stuff going here. But seriously, when it comes to one ingredient that I recommend that anyone take, it's dihydroberberine from GlucoVantage. All right, drop a comment, like it, share it, whatever. We, <laughs> we appreciate it. And Jay Cutler, keep making these badass supplements, dude. We super appreciate that someone of your caliber is just crushing it like you are. Thanks again. Welcome to Price Plow.